He's going to go with Lewis to Ferrari. We're going to get where eighth, and then we can retire. Oh, yeah, we did get down right. with that. Oh, no one told me it was a live podcast. I thought this was a pre recorded one. Who's who's ass at the minute? <laughs> <laughs> You're on the perfect show, bro. <laughs> Branding. Yuki Snowden. <laughs> Lando. Someone didn't say Max. <laughs> I've actually got some people going round to your flat now to burgle you. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you've never been busy, mate. You've never been busy. Hamilton Glory Ferrari oh, Yeah, yes, we're all all right. He's got enough chili for me, mate. He's got enough spice. He's going to do it. Who's going to win the championship this year? I'm going to think real hard about this yeah. one. <laughs> Ladies and gents, welcome back to Pit Stop. Your boys have made it. We're out the flat. Can you believe it? We've left the flat. And our look first at this. ever live look show. This. That's our logo. And Sky, I'm holding a Sky Sports microphone. We're going to have a load of guests joining us on the, on the sofa today. Little revolving door with a few mm. familiar faces. So, you know, stick around to the end of the video and maybe something weird might happen. It's going to be a great night. Bernie, thank Hello. you very much for joining us. Thank you, no problem. It's How good to cool be here. How cool is this here? It's wow. Yeah. You are the first guest to join us in our first ever live podcast. <laughs> <laughs> that's, a, that's an achievement. No one told me it was a live podcast. I thought this was a pre recorded Well, we're not live gonna... anyway. Oh, Don't right, worry okay, about okay. it. We're just in front of a little, little audience. <laughs> okay. We do have a little audience. We have a couple of questions we're going to ask everyone. Okay. Yeah, mm -hmm. a quick fire round. You just did it. Yeah, but we're that's fine. You. These ones These are, are probably a bit simple. Qu yeah, different questions. It's fine. Who's winning the championship this season? I think I'm going to have to say Verstappen. Okay. Sorry. What makes you think that? Um, <laughs> Sorry, that was the blandest question ever. <laughs> they look pretty confident, um, and that says a lot. I think when drivers are looking pretty confident at this stage, that says a lot. And that, you know, either way, even if the car wasn't amazing, they're the team to beat. I was sort of hopeful when the car looked very different to last year that there was going to be some mega mistake and we were going to see this tire. We don't know. Let's see what happens in Bahrain. Okay. Who do you think is going to be the biggest surprise? I think someone like Piastri is going to be the biggest nice. surprise. Because I think Norris is, was really strong last year. Piastri's got one year under his belt now. He's going to start to push someone like Norris. Um, and that car hopefully is good and going to get better through the year. I feel like the, the performance that he put in last year, he was already almost looking better than Lando in his rookie season. What he was lacking was race pace. And if he can improve that, improve his tire dag, then he can be right there at the end. Tire dag, something that we don't know that much about. <laughs> sorry, so sorry. We'll, we'll, we'll I've said it already. I've said it already. <laughs> Which team could be the biggest flop this year? Haas are sounding pretty negative. Mm. I don't think it's necessarily unexpected, but they're sounding pretty negative. I think someone like Williams, who were really on the up last year, have taken some risks with the car. Bit of unreliability through testing. So they really need to get that under control yeah. um, compared to last year. And last year they went in with no expectation. So it's easy to look strong when you're expectation managed. But mm. I think this year people are expecting them to build from last year. So that could be one to watch out for. Do you think we could be surprised by Visa cash app ripples? I think we'd be surprised by the number of mistakes that people are going to say in commentary when they're trying <laughs> yeah, to... I can't, I can't even remember the name. That's the first mistake there. <laughs> <When> <laughs> Visa <laughs> cash app ripples, Skype, go, whatever it is. I really, really can't wait to hear Crofty call that out in the panic <laughs> of the launch off the line because that's not going to go well. Um, yeah, I think the interesting... What, what they need to do is the car looks strong at this stage. The car should be strong in race one can they hold that through the years so with a new team of engineers with a strong car can they keep developing the car can they keep setting it upright we've seen strong teams in the past i think has a good example when they first joined they joined that year really strong the first few races car fell away from them yeah so can they keep it through the year that's going to be the big question for them who's next in line for the championship after max i'm really excited to see what mercedes can do particularly in 2026 with the new engine rex yeah. That's their big opportunity, I think, which is even more surprising why Lewis has left just before that. But anyway, um, so someone like Russell has got to be a possibility. But then I think you have to look to the Norrises, the Piastris of the world. They are going to be the guys that are going to be pushing. They're the ones that look really fast yeah. out there. Absolutely. Would love Piastri to win. Well, Bernie, thank Norris you very much be for annoyed. <laughs> Yeah, Norris would be annoyed. <laughs> Ladies and gents, we're landing! Let's go! What a great guest to join us Hi. on the sofas! Good to see you, man. Like good to you, see you. I'm good, I'm good. Um, um, apprehensive for the season ahead, I wouldn't say. Oh, uh, yeah. My hopes are too high as a, as a staunch <laughs> Lewis fan, but we'll see. We'll see. Well, we've got some quick fire questions for you, mate. Okay. But before then. what your F1 knowledge is like, but. We'll see, we'll see. No, we're before not great under pressure. Big news. Let's talk about it. You've joined Quadrant. I have, yes, I have. Yeah. I've got an office job now. I'm. <laughs> 
just help it out behind the scenes. It's good fun, man. It's That's good amazing, fun. man. Yeah. Yeah, really cool. Keep it sorted. Right, number one. Mm. Everyone has given the same answer so far, so okay. feel free to be as bold as you want. Who's winning the championship this year? Well, it's obvious. It's it's Max. It's Max. We're it's waiting not, for no, someone to no say something else. even humour in a different <laughs> one. Who's going to be the biggest surprise this year? Biggest surprise? In terms of negative or positive? Oh. Either. There's it a negative question the, coming up. So. It could be the, the good old Visa Cash Up RBs. They could just rock up and be yeah. like podium contenders. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, that would be a bit mortifying. Uh, who else have we got? I'll stick with them. Like, I think yeah. they could just come out and know. Yuki or Danny, instantly. both? Do you know what? I would go with Yuki. Yeah. I weirdly would just... I, weirdly, I just... That's what my heart's saying. I just feel like, as of late, he just still feels like the team leader there. Yeah, yeah. We'll yeah, see, though. We'll see. Well, right, which team could be the biggest flop this year, then? Biggest flop. I yeah. think we're looking... Has to look a dead cert, but apart from Alpine, <laughs> <Dead sir. laughs> you, have you heard the stuff coming out about Alpine? Though it's just like I've not say, heard one positive thing said about that car. Well, it's apart, like apart it's too delivery. draggy. It's useless in the corners. It seems like there's a real inquest going on there. So I will say, we expect Has to to be there. We maybe don't expect Alpine. I would say they will underperform compared expectations the most. It's the paint job, isn't it? I it mean, is, really, it's the paint job. <laughs> <laughs> Who do you think will win the World Championship after Max? Once Max is done. Oh, okay. I, I will say big Ferrari link up, right? I'm saying knew he's going to ditch Red Bull. He's going to go with Lewis to Ferrari. We're going to get our eighth and then we can retire. Oh, we did get down right? with that. Oh, it's going to happen. It's going to happen. And the fact you didn't say Lando, I respect that. Respect oh, come that. Come on, come on. I, well, when, when Lewis <laughs> goes, right? I'm, I've been Lewis since childhood. When he goes, then I can move on. But I feel like whilst he's here, I can't jump ship just yet. Okay. No. Mega. Fair enough. Come on. All right. Well, mate, thanks oh, for joining we'll us on the sofa. See, you. Yeah. So see you in a bit. Oh, Cheers, bro. Oh, thanks so much. Thank you, bro. Cheers. Go on, go on. Great work, Ted. You done that before? Uh, so many times. Ted, it's good to see you, mate. Good to see you. I'm Let's like see your your uh, your flats changed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Seems to be sponsored now. I know. By, can you believe uh, it? How can you believe that? it? The pit in stop fact, logo next to Sky Sports. In fact, you're not really branded enough, are you? I'll be back in a. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, what's going on? What is going on? <laughs> oh oh look wow, at that. Ted, there what a treat! Now, <laughs> I feel like I'm being knighted. <laughs> God, Ted, Jeez, thank you. Ted. You are honestly so Sir kind. <laughs> and one Sir for yourself. Fabio, <laughs> Sir Jake, arrived. Oh, you got two for yourself, very nice. I have got two for myself. There you go, got some more brand. Unlike the other two guests that we've just had on, we have actually met you before quite a have. few times. I've actually got some people going round to your flat now to burgle you, given that everything's in here. All the equipment is... Uh, it's here. It's all right. You can take them off. Don't worry. I was only joking. Yeah, we've got some quick fire questions. We'll just reel them off. There's about, there's only five here. Mm -hmm. yeah. So I feel like you're the man with the answers. Well, <laughs> you might not like them. <laughs> Who's winning the championship this year? Uh, maximum Verstappening. Yeah, is Maximum winning. Verstappening. He See, is. everyone has said different things. He is. They have, indeed. Exactly. No have one they? has said Max no yet at all. Said that. No one has said Max yet. <laughs> Who's going to be the biggest surprise this year? Uh, RB or whatever they're calling themselves these days. <laughs> I'm glad I we're not the only ones. Anyone. I don't think anyone knows. I, mean, I think early on, they're going to kind of do an Aston Martin of last year. Um, but I think then Aston Martin will catch up and then do an Aston Martin of themselves. Yeah, yeah. Uh, McLaren will get there as well, but no one's really, you know, not expecting McLaren to be scoring podiums. Um, so, yeah, uh, early on, uh, yeah, Red Bull's second team, V carb or whatever they're called. Very, very nice. What team do you think will be the biggest flop this year? Gosh, I don't think any of them will be a, a flop because they all seem to be much closer together than last year. Um, so even if, you know, Alpine or Haas are at the back, it will only take half a second. Yeah. A driver mistake or a change in conditions or a tire pressure here or a turn of wing there for them not to be a flop. So if they're flopping one week, then stay with them because they're going to unflop in unfloppable to not be a flop. Right. Okay. When they're not flopping. I wish I could hear what you're saying so right now. But <laughs> so much noise. I don't think anyone. <laughs> I'm just kind of nodding. Anyone's going to be. I'm completely with spending, you, Ted. You've been I'm spending too much time in racing cars. You see. I know. How's your lip reading? Better than I thought. Well, actually. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> the thing is, these are these are rock star mics. Yeah, they so are. So what does that mean? You can SM, sing. I'm a I'm a mic geek. So these are SM58s. Oh, you so know you your see stuff, the, actually. So you can absolutely 
you know, scream down these. Give it some welly, yeah. Give it some welly. So these yeah. are the same mics I use in the pit lane. Are you a bit of a music head then? Do, have I done music? You strike me as like a, as a guitar player. No, no, no. Uh, Singer. No, I used to play drums. I play drums. Do you have an uh, electronic we set should, at home? We should have a, a real set. Well, yeah, we live in a flat, so I've got like an electric. Okay, kit. yeah, we've got an electronic electric yeah. drum. Yeah, we've Roland. Got the, um, the Roland. Yeah, the with the with the the uh, web. Um, I have no idea what they're on about. With the mesh heads. Yep. Yeah. However, he still says they're incredibly loud, and he it's shakes only the, the whole kick. flat. It's only the kick that's really loud. It's yeah. annoying. I need to get actually. There's a mesh um, little bit for the kick pedal. I can't believe they're having this conversation. <laughs> One problem, I can't, my hi-hat is too low in the mix of all the other drums. Oh yeah, you can turn it up. You can turn it you up. You can turn it up. Yeah, yeah, I'll yeah. have to come over and I'll show okay, you. Okay, yeah, I'll come over and sort my Roland uh, mesh head drum kit. It's done. You can cook your dinner as well. He's an amazing cook. I'm, I'm sure. I'll cook you dinner. It. We can have a drum shred. Um, yeah. Well, I don't know how much of the world knew that about Ted Kravitz, no. so maybe that's an exclusive. Sorry, what was the question? <laughs> I've got no, no idea. No, no, we're sorry. The most important question we're going to ask, who do you think will be the next world champion after Verstappen? What, that hasn't already been a world champion? Just who's next in line who's for the world championship? Lando is as fast, has proved that he's pretty much as fast as Max. And if you equate where Oscar is with Lando, you might say that Oscar is getting to be as fast mm -hmm. as Max as well. Yeah. So you've got to join that into the, you know, Hamilton, Willie, won't he tra yeah. tra challenge at Ferrari. Um, let's say Max wins the next two. Uh, 24 and 25. New rules, 26. Let's say Mercedes, let's say they, they, they don't pay attention, they discount, put aside next year. Um, so they're going to be Russell and probably Antonelli by that time. Yep. Maybe yeah. Alonso will do one year, but then they'll certainly get Antonelli after two years. Yeah. So it's either going to be Russell or Antonelli is the answer to your question. Wow, oh my God. God. that's a clip. clip. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to go viral, Ted. But then who's to say that Red Bull aren't going to do the same? They're going to be so far ahead yeah. in yeah. 2025 that they'll concentrate on 2026. Crazy rule changes coming for 26. They're changing the size of the car a little changing bit, Changing the size they? of the car. The, Which I think is what everyone wants. Rear wings are going to kind of change shape completely. Front and rear, you know, movable aero. It's going to be like those cool cars that kind of go, you know. A transformer, road cars. is that what yeah. you mean? <laughs> well, no, I think you can't, can't you buy some road cars if you've like got millions that sort of change the shape of themselves on the road? When you're at your level of showbiz, you, you have stuff available to you, which us pure peasants, Maybe we, it was we just don't like have. like a concept car that I saw in a, a motor show oh, that like had. the BMW and the wheel arches move. Yeah, is that yeah, what you yeah. mean? Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, there we go, Ted, thank you for joining us. Thank you. Thank you, mate. Two microphones. I want to see use two if you want. Yeah. Oh, that's it's, mega. It's a good look. That's mega. It's a great Branding. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Nicole Holiday. Football's favourite. Yay. Up the gunners, eh? Come on, you gunners. Up and all the that. gunners. Oh yeah, I forget you're an Arsenal yes, fan. An Arsenal. I thought you were a City fan. Pardon? I thought you were a City fan. You're Have I blown it already? You're just trying to wind I've me up. I've blown it already, innit? Do you know what? Just. Yeah, thank you so much. <laughs> this is so much thank better God. now. Thought it'd never happen. God. Wait, do you know anything about football yet or no? Yeah, of course. Manchester City are the, are the he top, knows a lot top about of the league. City. Top of the league. Okay. Right? Yeah. They are. I made that up, but well, it, it was right. I'm surprised you got that right. Well, it's Only Liverpool just. at the top at the moment. Oh, actually. yeah, they're second. It's City are in second. <laughs> right, on to F1. <laughs> yeah, well, you're a new F1 fan, aren't you? I am. So I'm not going to lie. I'm one of those that watched Drive to Survive a couple of years ago. So did we. Right? And how good of a series. I sound like amazing. I'm the exec producer. It's amazing. <laughs> but for what it wanted to do to attract a new wider audience, yeah, yeah, yeah. what an amazing job it did. And it got me hooked. And I've been to a few races at Silverstone. Oi, oi. You don't look very impressed. Jesus. No, no, we're impressed. We're it's impressed. not Monaco, Steady. all right. But, you know, maybe this year, Sky Sports. Okay, if you want. <laughs> I don't know which camera. Call me. <laughs> don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> but my knowledge isn't the best. I'm listening to a few more podcasts. You're on the right. Don't listen to us if you want to learn anything. <laughs> if you don't want to learn anything. There's a few more that you can listen to other than us, just to let you know. First question, Nicole. Oh, gosh. Who's going to be the biggest surprise this season? Okay, in terms of driver or team? Anything you want, anything you want. Okay, I, oh, I'm going to say... If we're all dancing, oh, she's dancing, dancing a lot better, don't she's dancing, it's coming. Williams. Williams, they could be a big surprise this yeah. year. Any, any... What reason? Because uh, I've been watching this series of Drive to Survive and I just quite like them, so I think they might surprise us and do a bit better. Yeah, yeah. 
Yeah, yeah that, that's, a, that's a solid answer. Does yeah, it, that's a point for that. Does that count as an counts. answer? It counts. It counts. <laughs> Who do you think will win the World Championship this year? Oh, I mean, okay, let's not say Max Verstappen. I like that it's answer. Yeah. Let's not say yeah. him. Yeah, yeah. But, Bold. no, no, we'll go, we'll go right. Well, then we can go right. to my next question. Okay. After Max is done winning, who will be the next World Champion? Do you mean who will come second? Or once Max stops no, winning not in come however second, long? Yeah, once Max is done. When, once Max leaves, Or his retires. car falls to, yeah. <laughs> once his car, if, if, if the Red Bull is just no good next year, who's Okay, next? sure. I reckon it'll be Lewis. Hamilton in Ferrari. Nice, oh. that's what we all want. Yeah, it, yeah. Would, it would be nice. Imagine that drive survive season. Hamilton M winning maybe, in Ferrari. Uh, like Lando. Yeah. I was going to say I like Lando. Lando. I actually saw Lando years ago at a Sky Sports F1 event, maybe like five years ago, and he was oh, so He must little. have been about twelve then. He was a small, small child. <laughs> yeah. And he was so sweet, and they were doing a little quiz and. It was lovely, and I was like, oh, what a cute little boy. And now I'm like, oh my God, this man. It's Lando is Norris. brilliant. I sound like I know him. Like we're best mates, we grew up together. I'm really proud of everything he's now achieved. Um, no, we, never, we never saw it coming, you know. We were so quiet in school. Shocked. Who could be the biggest flop this year? Haas. Good answer. <laughs> Good answer. I mean, they yes. probably are going to be pretty bad. I mean, <laughs> they've lost Gunther. You know, he was the star what of DTS. What a legend! I know he's gone. What a hero! But I think he knows he's a bit of a legend now, and he knows he's kind of main character energy, and he's kind of going to go out there. I mean, he's got a, a book, an audio book, and all that yep. that he was doing yep. right yep. during the series. I think he's he's going to be in a film there. If he had time to write a book during being a principal, he clearly isn't no just focused on... No wonder it's not worked on, out <laughs> yeah, <laughs> so well. When you put two and two together, it kind of adds up, really, doesn't it? kind of makes sense, yeah. We Don't do disrespect him like that. No, no. I feel like Haas kind of... The only thing they had going for them was Gunther, and now they're left, I don't really know what they've well, got. Well, because he bought the charisma and the something-something. That's, something. That's the end of our quickfire questions. That's the end of the quickfire <laughs> questions, Nicole Holiday. So good to see you. What are we Thank doing? Thank you for joining us. <laughs> <laughs> what are we going for? Bus. An Elmer fist bump, yay! <laughs> Where am I looking? Just at you guys, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> they just stared straight on <laughs> the back of the camera <laughs> <laughs> with all your answers. <laughs> <laughs> this camera's for me. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gents, Nitro the Gladiator. What is happening? How are good we? On. Good, We're man. Here. Good to have you here. We're vibing. Mate, how's Gladiator? Gladiator is, is epic, obviously. Um, you know, it's one of those nostalgic shows that you can't get away from, makes you happy. It's been making the nation happy, which has been great. Mate, I used to watch you when I was a kid. I can't believe you're on it now. Uh, and after Fab beat Mate, you in a I, running race. I I, it's not me, there's a guy called Nitro. I don't know who he is. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mate, it is about time we had round yeah. two at a race. Mate, we, we are due a race, but maybe we should go up a wall this time. Nah, <laughs> nah, 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 I ain't gonna win. I beat you last time. Yeah, to be fair, I'm, those little feet of yours, they can move. But you were in jeans yeah. and you, were, you had no shoes I'm on. I'm ready for you today. That's why I wore my joggers. <laughs> you had an injury last time, mate. I did. I did. I was injured last time. So now that I'm fully fit, I think we Excuses. should go. I'll, I, won't, I, won't, I won't ease up either. I'll give yeah. you the full, you know. All right. Maybe we could do a tag team as well. You can get involved as well. A relay. A relay. A relay. A we'll still yeah. lose, mate. It would be both of us. <laughs> tag team. Mate, we got some questions for you about Formula One. Cool. Like three or four quick fire questions. You ready? Yep, yeah, let's go. Let's see. Let's, let's see what I've got. Who's going to be the biggest surprise this year? Oh, gosh. Um, I mean, Verstappen's obviously going to win. Um, well, there goes our first question. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> so the biggest surprise, I don't know. Could we see Lando Norris nick a few podiums? That would be great. I think it's that possible. That would be great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. maybe nick a few more podiums in terms of, you know, not not getting number one on pole, but oh sorry, number one in terms of winning, but maybe getting second. Yeah. What do you think? Yeah, a few more, few more, few yeah, more podiums. You're not far off. Yeah, yeah that's pretty yeah. Yeah. nice. <laughs> is that much of a surprise <laughs> though? <laughs> <laughs> right, bro, so we all we all think Max is going to win this yeah, year, right? Yeah. But when Max is done winning, who do you think will be the next world champion after Max? I don't know. So I'd like to think George Russell okay. might might do a little something. You know, he's. He's British as well. There's obviously yeah. Lando. He's there. One of those two. I'd like to see one of those two kind of take the mantle. Do you think Hamilton can win it at Ferrari? Do you think he's gone there I, to I, win I, the world championship? <laughs> or do you think he's not going to win? I, I think Lewis, if anyone's going to do it, it's going to be him. And I would love to see it. I can't really lie. Love it. I genuinely... Him wearing the red. I know. He looks good in red, as man. As a world champion. I've got to say, he looks what? good in red. <laughs> With a little cane row as well. Come on, yeah. get out of here. <laughs> All right, who's going to be the biggest flop this year? Biggest flop? Yeah. I don't know, mate. Who's going to flop? Who can I... 
Daniel. Who are you going to throw under the bus? Do you know what I mean? Who am I going to... Are we looking at Haas or Alpine, maybe? Who's, who's that Haas at the minute? <laughs> <laughs> You're on the perfect show, bro. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> I've been paying attention to Haas. You're early, aren't you? <laughs> You're Kevin Magnussen and Nico Hulkenberg. Oh. I think that's hard to say. Nico, I don't think he would flop. Flop's a bit of a harsh word, yeah. you know, but like, you get the like, gist. Yeah, I don't know, man. That's a harsh one for me to answer. Who's not going to do as well? Team yeah. has never done too well, do they? So no, just and they've just lost two. Gunther as well. <laughs> that's what I'm trying to say. It's going to be one of those two. <laughs> <laughs> mate, you smashed it. Yeah, really Let's go. Brother, it's always so good to see you. No, it's good to always see you, good mate. to see you guys, man. You guys are doing well. Yeah, we're enjoying Fly, it. Flying we're enjoying the F1 it. flag, which is always nice to see. Yeah, great man. stuff, man. You're doing your bits, man. It's going good. It feels good. Let us know when we can come on Gladiators, bro. We're there. You're there. You're going to come on and... Bro, I'm in peak physical fitness, mate. Yeah, that's what I like to see, man. <laughs> <laughs> You're saying this in front of a Greek god. Right? I know. <laughs> this guy up. has always got I'm his clothes off. off. Do you want me to... I'm oh, surprised. Bro. Bro. You see it through the shirt. Whenever you want. Check this out. Oh. Oh. Hey, I've been going gym. They're not going the pit gym. boys anymore, mate. They're the pet boys. Come on. <laughs> mate, let's Energy. go. Right My god. All the love. All the love. <laughs> Ladies and gents, Katie Fallon. Hey! Thank you for joining us. Thank you for having me. Yeah. How cool is this? I know. You've got your own little section here. I know. It's so official, guys. Look at the logo. <laughs> stunning. <laughs> Three questions for you about the upcoming season. Let's do it. Let's okay. go. Who do you think will win the World Championship after Max? Hmm. I'm going to go with Carlos Sainz. Let's go Go out there. Go big. Uh, go you're the second person to have said that. Oh, okay. Maybe not so bold. Who's had it <laughs> yeah, let's go oh, crazy. Yeah. Who's going to be the biggest surprise this year? Uh, well, Oscar Piastri had a pretty amazing year last year, but I think that maybe he could really take it to Lando this year. And uh, who knows, maybe he'll actually get a first Grand Prix win before Lando. Maybe. Maybe. Uh, what do you think we can expect out of the Visa Cash App Red Bulls, whatever they're called? <laughs> whatever they're called. Uh, hopefully some clarification on what we're going to call them. Yeah, that would be a great uh, start. But I think Yuki has a lot to prove, obviously against Ricardo, Like, they had some time together towards the end of last season, but... I think this is still a really important year for him. Obviously, the aim of being in that RB, cash app, whatever we're going to call it, um, is to, to be progressing up to that Red Bull seat. But if Daniel comes in and gets promoted to Red Bull straight away, where does that leave Yuki? Because yeah. he's missed so many opportunities to get that promotion. So yeah. I think that's going to be a crucial year for him. Nice. And yeah, let's see if Daniel does make that jump up to Red Bull. Uh, you think he can? We're all hoping for it. I think he can, but I also think that he's got to be sensible about this move because he's been there before. He knows he's never going to be able to take it. It's not good to go back to an ex. It's true. That is good I've enough. learned that way. Yeah. 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 I've really blown it a couple of times. <laughs> um, yeah, I think let's see how it plays out. But I think at the moment, if Daniel can cement himself and make himself number one of that team, for me, I think that's probably the safer option of the two because he doesn't. He's already had the time with McLaren that obviously didn't end too well. Time with Renault ended a bit sourly. Like, yeah. you know, I'm not saying he should retire tomorrow, but he's not getting any younger. Maybe he just needs to have a team where he knows he can be top dog in that team and, you know, finish there. But we know what these drivers are like. They're always going to be want to be at that top team. He wants to be at Red Bull chasing Max. Yeah. So yeah, of course, yeah, yeah. Which team could be a flop this year? Well, there's been lots of talk about Alpine. I mean. I'm, yeah, yeah, we'll see. I mean, I'm still disappointed that we didn't get the camo pink nose. Yeah. I know that's a really like superficial thing to say, but you can't see something as beautiful as that and then not deliver <laughs> and just put all carbon on the car. But yeah, Alpine, um, we'll see how Haas get on with Gunter Steiner. He was such an integral part to that team yeah. throughout their time in F1. Even before they made it into F1, he was such a key player there. So. Let's see how they get on without him, but... Thank you very much for joining us hey, on the sofa. Have a great night. Thanks. <laughs> Anthony Davidson. Anthony Hello, mate. Davidson. Thanks for joining us. Hi, guys. Yeah, no problem at all. It's nice to be here. It's the first time that we've met. I, I think it is. It I've is definitely. Obviously, I've seen you, as you've probably seen me, but yeah, yeah, it's yeah. nice to see you guys in the flesh. We love nice your one. insight. Thanks we very absolutely much. love your insight. We do indeed. And because we love your insight so much, we've got some quick fire questions. Oh, no, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to be asking these to everyone, though, so you can be as bold as you right. want. Right. Yep. Okay. Go Starting for it. Starting off, then. number one, very plain and basic. I'm pretty sure everyone's going to say the same thing. Who's going to win the championship this year? Max Verstappen. There we go. Okay. Yeah, there we'll we go. Yeah, the let's just, let's just get that out of there. Yeah. Yeah, let's just, yeah. Put that to bed right I now. I hope yeah. there's someone who gives us like a really rogue answer yeah. from that. that Yuki uh, Sonoda. That's what okay. I said over there. That's the bit we'll clip. Could be. <laughs> clip you never know. I mean, <laughs> Who's going to be the biggest surprise this year? Yuki Sonoda. 
<laughs> Perfect. <laughs> you never let that RB car, you know? What it's, is going on with that car? So how much of Red Bull have they got? Nobody really knows, but I would assume maybe quite a bit. How much are they uh, allowed? Uh, well, I mean, it's within the regulations. So it's, you know, that if, you look at, if you look at the Williams, it's got last year's Mercedes gearbox suspension. Is that, do you think that's fair, though? I mean... Again, that would never yeah. happen in another sport, though. Like you couldn't have one guy owning two football teams, could you? Yeah. It is a bit. It is a bit like I've, I've had first-hand experience of that with Super Aguri, of course, and Honda. Yeah. So I've reaped the benefits of the A team, literally giving a team a, a car to another team, albeit the car from last season. Yeah. It's a, it's a grey area, basically. It's very, and, and that's why, cleverly, Red Bull and Alpha Tauri, RB whatever you want to call them these days there it's a great collaboration mm. i don't think you launch a car in vegas with that much paint on it if you haven't got something <laughs> they must have the, something under the carbon fiber we'll surely. have to wait and see. see but i mean the car from what i could see in bahrain it, it is up there it's i would definitely place them at the the at the bottom end of second best after red bull what team do you think will be the biggest flop this year that's tough tough one because looking over the course of the whole season, you've got to obviously look at that development race. Yeah. And uh, I mean, I think Haas had a very difficult They're test. Struggling a Maybe bit. they didn't show everything, but I think even the drivers were were fairly open in that. You know, there's a long way to go. And maybe they would be. I wouldn't. It's harsh to call it a flop because it, you know, it, it's still a, a great looking car and it's in, it's fast. It's just relatively speaking. Uh, I, I I can't see them challenging the high end of the midfield yeah. early on in the season at least uh, on multiple tracks for the first five, six races. Predictions for the new teams, Stake and, and Visa RB. We kind of just covered yeah. RB, but what about Stake? It's funny you say new team, new new name. Yeah, uh, new sponsor, yeah, really. Yeah, new yeah. It's, it's, the new same, it's the same core crew, just with a different colour scheme and, and, uh, and So and do you think it will names. make much difference at all, really? I don't think it will make a, a huge difference immediately. Everyone's made a significant improvement over last year's cars. That's what, that was very clear to see in Bahrain. If you look at last year's pole position time of a 129.7 from Max, and the year before that from Leclerc was a 130.3 or, or 5 from memory. Uh, How they, do you remember that? Because uh, I literally <laughs> just come back from home. <laughs> and then, so Sauber ended the test with, I think it was a 30.3. So they're somewhere close to the potential of, of the fastest cars from years before. Wow, when you put it like that. Yeah. Mm, yeah. So they must be running their car. You can deduce from that that they must be running their car fairly close to optimum. Who's next in line for the World Championship after Max? That is a very good question. I, I don't have that answer. Who knows how many uh, he's going to win be, in a row, but... It could be Lewis. It could be. I mean, wouldn't that be a fairy tale it, story? Yeah, 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 Ferrari he wins, he wins another championship. But I think th it will be whatever it is, it will be 2026. Okay, yeah. And, yeah, let's say... Let's go, let's go Lando. Very but good. It's a brave call because he hasn't won a race yet. But I think he really has the potential he to does. be a future world champion. For yeah. sure. All right, well... Here's just one little bonus question for you. Stick Alonso in the Red Bull. What do you think happens then? Good. It's a good question. I think when Alonso was, dare I say, when he was younger, in his, in his he's in, only a rookie when still. A, when he was in in <laughs> Renault, that would have been really, really, I think, a really close fight. Yeah. I think Max is, he's unbeatable in that car right now. Yeah. I think he would beat him. It would be close. But I do think you beat him. Well, there we go, man. Thank you very much for joining us on this little Thank you so much. live show that we've done. Cheers, mate. No problem, yeah. Thank good you. Fun. Thanks very thank much. You. Hello. How are we? We good? Yeah, very, we're doing very well. well. Doing well. How are you? Yeah, very good, thank you. Good stuff. We've got some quick fire questions. We're just gonna, we've got three questions for you. We're just going to smash them out. Go for it. Who's going to be the biggest surprise in Formula One this year? Lando Norris. Very, very yeah. nice. Any backing? No, I'm just, I like him, and uh, I think he deserves a win. So I'm hoping this season. He does the one. deserve a win. Yeah, Fair maybe enough. Albon. I'm a big Albon fan too. So. Albon's very, very quick. Yeah, I like him. Yeah, he is actually quick. Yeah, he needs a better car, doesn't he, to be honest? Yeah, the Williams is getting there, though. So, I mean, we'll see after a few races. Who's going to be the biggest flop this year? Oh, that's harsh, really. Do you know, only on what I've read, I'm going to say uh, Alpine. Only on what I've read, like from testing and then being slow. You ain't the first one to say that either. Okay, okay. <laughs> I want to know what you've read. I just. Just from a online browsing, just they're a bit heavy, like very overweight, a bit a bit sluggish in the corners. All right, final question: Who do you think will win the world championship after Max? After Max, okay, I'm gonna throw out there. 
Hamilton glory Ferrari season. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's what we're all about. I like Max, but I'm, I'm thinking a Hamilton glory Ferrari season. I think we, we all want that, nice. don't we? Yeah, that'd be class. Yeah, yeah. That'd be Sweet. the dream season. You'd go mad. I'd lose my shit. Yeah, my favourite team ever. No, so. fair play. Who's your favourite team? Well, I, I like Max, so I have to say Red Bull, but yeah. my granddad was Italian, so I have to like Ferrari a bit as yeah, well. Yeah, you yeah. Know? Good, You've got that Good Italian stuff. blood, haven't you? I've got a little streak in me. Yeah, yeah, yeah I rate it. I rate it. <laughs> Is this close enough to my mouth? Are we good? A bit yeah. closer. A bit closer. closer. Yeah, that's it. Get it right, right in, there. in the face. Three quick fire Formula One questions for you. Okay. okay. Right. Who do you think will win the championship this year? Lando. Someone didn't say Max. Controversial. <laughs> what, what, I mean, what facts are you basing that on? I just think he deserves it. I refuse to let Max win again. He uh, does deserve it. He does. But it's got to be Max. Interesting. Fair enough. Interesting. How about after Max, when Max doesn't win anymore, then who will win? So Lando. Just both say Lando? Or Charles, yeah. Okay, decent. All right. Well, who's going to be the biggest surprise this year? Ooh. Team or driver? I really want to say. Bad or I, good? I want to say Yuki. I want to see more he's, from him. Yeah, I love yeah? him. Bad or good surprise though? Either. Okay. I feel like Mercedes aren't going to do as well as they should. <laughs> no. Okay. After watching testing, okay. testing has not been good for them, but we kind of predicted that anyway. So. Hamilton's leaving, so they surely have an amazing car. I know exactly. It doesn't really matter anymore. Does it? I feel no. like most people are like leaving Mercedes fan base after this year. Do you think Hamilton can win his next world title at Ferrari? Absolutely, a million percent. A hundred, a million, yeah. hundred million percent. Yes, we yeah. have faith. He's ready. He's <laughs> ready. That's what everyone wants. Isn't it? <laughs> yeah, I we feel want like to we're see all, it. We're all hoping for that. Final question: The Visa Cash App Red Bulls, whatever they're called. <laughs> yep. Who do you think outperforms who? Danny Rick or Sonoda? Who do you think gets more points? I think Yuki will Yuki. this season. I think so as yes. well. We've got a little Yuki, Yuki fan yeah. club over he's here. He's not a rookie anymore. No, he's going to be good. I love Danny Rick. I love him, but I just feel like he's like he's off his game. We missed a question. The biggest flop. Who do you think is going to be the biggest flop this year? Oh, I feel really bad, but I want to say Danny Rick. I don't know why. <laughs> I still love him, but... You think he's just lost it a little bit up yeah, here? Yeah, I do. Yeah. I really, I really yeah. do. I feel like he's lost his confidence so much over the past few years. And... Yeah. I just don't see him getting it back. Yeah. I want to say Lance, but... <laughs> <laughs> it's no. all right, he'll keep his seat no matter what he does. So. Yeah. Oh, yeah. so true. <laughs> so true. Yeah. Well, great stuff, guys. Sweet. Thank you very Thank much. You. Well, that was it. Enjoy your night. <laughs> Thank Thanks, you. you too. Camera, mate, how are we doing? Doing well, how are you guys? Very, very well. Very well. Doing well. We've, we've met you before. Yeah, I think we met at the last Sky event, or last one I went to, which was the Spa uh, event F last F1 year. F1 Arcade, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah, yeah. yeah. That was what, last year? End of, I mean, we're only in Feb, so it was definitely yeah, last year. Like yeah. The season is officially here. I know, it's exciting. We're going to start off with who's going to win the championship this year. <laughs> I'm going to think real hard about this yeah. one. <laughs> I'm going to say Verstappen. Okay. Who's going to be the biggest surprise this year? Ooh, I think I think Mercedes is going to surprise us. I think they've they've got nice. something up their sleeve. They're going to put all this, pull all this what stuff have they got? Lewis. Can you go further on that? I have zero freaking <laughs> clue, but yeah, I think they've got something. You mean at the, the team in general, you think the car's yeah. going to be better I this year? I think the team, yeah, the team's going to make a step forward. Like, they have to, right? But would yeah. Hamilton have left if Mercedes had something? Would he be leaving, you know? that That's a good point, but maybe it's just the time time to take the check. Fair enough. Fair, <laughs> fair, enough. Really fair, enough. fair enough. Okay, which team could be the biggest flop this year? Biggest flop? The biggest flop, yeah, like just... No good. Part of me thinks Ferrari's going to struggle a little bit, which is kind of contrary to the whole Hamilton philosophy. But just in testing, I think they struggled a little bit in race pace. So I don't know. I think they're going to struggle a bit, at least in the beginning. Yeah. Imagine if Sainz outperforms Leclerc. Oh, that's another good that's point. That's what we've yeah, been yeah. saying. Yeah, absolutely. It could genuinely happen because he's got nothing left to lose now. No. You know, he knows that his contract's up, so he's just going to, I think he's just going to go for it this year. No, and he's been right there this whole time. Yeah, so I'm, I'm quite surprised that, you know, they did him dirty a little bit with that yeah. one, but at the same yeah. time, it's Hamilton, right? So. Yeah. Who do you think will be the next world champion after Max? When Max is done winning, who do you think takes that championship? Norris. Norris? I Norris. think it's a Norris strong is answer. One. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I think he's. He's smart, his management's smart, and they'll make the right decisions to put him in, the, in a good seat. Love it. You pick Bro. him over Oscar? Um, when, I, when I think about the package behind him as well, and, and the people working with him, yeah. It's a fair, fair answer. Mm -hmm. Mate, thank you for joining us on yeah, the sofa. Absolutely. Yeah. Enjoy good your night. See you, see you in a bit. Nice one, brother. What's the no, Multi-talented. Aren't you injured, Pen? Uh, I did actually uh, fracture a rib about three weeks ago, which was a bit annoying. I uh, mm. couldn't race in the race that I was planned on doing. But uh, getting better. I was in the gym today, and it's getting back to normal uh, that's good to hear boys well we've got some quick fire questions for you Love sounds it. good yeah the first one is actually the first one is the worst question i think we've ever it's asked it's the worst ever. question we've ever so, asked I mean, anyone who's winning the championship this year max max yeah. okay 
It's pretty easy. I mean, <laughs> yeah, I mean, everyone said the yeah, same yeah. thing. Oh, okay, uh, uh, Joe. Go go go. Go. That's a better clip. Go on your Joe. Uh, nice. Logan Sargent. Nice. Fair enough. All right, think about this one a bit more then. Who will win the championship after Max? When he's done winning, who will be the next world champion? Carlos Sainz. You think? Uh, he's going to have that come. dog in him after the sacking, mate. He's going to be fired up right now. Where will he be? Wherever. <laughs> he's got enough, he's got <laughs> he enough chili for me, mate. He's got enough spice. <laughs> he's going to do it. He could get in a harse and win the thing. <laughs> after that fire. Carlos after Sainz, after yeah. that I treatment. Reckon, yeah. After that treatment. I mean, he, he's the one that won last year. He's the only guy who didn't win. Uh, who won, I mean. Science. And... Uh, yeah, I reckon Sainz Facts. too. Yeah. Facts. All right. Sainz is Sainz. the next one. Who's going to be the biggest surprise this year? Logan Sargent. Yeah, I'm going Logan as <laughs> Comeback well. Comeback tour is on. That? The fully insured world tour of Logan Sargent yeah. is going to be uh, massive. Yeah. And Any backing on this? He's going to outscore Alex by 15 and a half points by the end of the year. 15 and a half? Yeah. So you're predicting a half be a, race? It's going to be a wet race that gets called off halfway yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's where the half comes from. All right. Yeah. Nice. Clem? I'm going Valtteri, you know. Nice. Is it the mullet? It's the hair. It's <laughs> yeah. the it's the it's, it's the, the whole vibe, you know. He, I mean, he looks at least ten percent faster with that hair. So. Oh, hundred percent. I honestly think a good haircut can gain you three tenths, and a shit haircut can actually lose you, you three lose tenths. tenths. <laughs> he's yeah. Yeah. he's seen the stock well. price of Australians in Formula One between what Piastri's been getting, all the attention there. You know, the Ricardo decision going that way. He's yeah. seen what the Australians get. And he's starting to mimic it. It's smart branding. Yeah, yeah. Fair, that's fair enough. What about biggest flop? Who's going to flop this year? Uh, Sauber. Okay. Sauber, Stake, whatever they need to call themselves to get around the last well, single Well, this is going to be the biggest yeah, no, surprise. And you think Boss they're going to flop? Gonna... Yeah, I know. This is going to be a huge rift between us throughout 2024. <laughs> yeah. I can, I can yeah. see that already. But, um, you know, I think, I think it's going to be the Sauber, Stake. I'm not really too sure what we're called, team. Clem, biggest flop? Looking at testing? I'm going Alpine, you know. Alpine. Okay, fair yeah, enough. And, and the dynamic the within the team as well. I don't, know, I don't know they're best. They're not best friends. Yeah, this is not very French of you. It's not very French team. Mate. Alpine. Two I French think. drivers, it's French team. I thought you would be a go Full support French. team. Mate. Yeah, no, I think uh, it will be a difficult time for Alpine this year. <laughs> we don't normally see you boys at events. What's the big date night for tonight? No, usually? we're starting a new company soon, so we need to start getting our faces out there yeah. a bit more. But that's all to be confirmed. Oh, what's, what's, what's the company? No, we can't, for legal reasons, we can't say. Oh, oh, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we'll um, tell you off air, you know? Yeah. yeah. All right, cut the cameras. Cut. Well, guys, that's the end of it. What a, what a day. Amazing. Can't believe we have left the flat for one, but also we have done our first live show. This is absolutely amazing. Sky Sports F1, thank you so much for having us. Yeah, thanks to all the guests that joined us here today. And don't forget, you can catch all of the races this season exclusively on Sky Sports. Hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, and we'll see you guys soon. Come on! Goodbye!